Okay, so now we're going to take a look at our student edition for our Into Math series. And this is our newest math series at HMH. And what we're looking at here happens to be a grade three student workbook. Okay, and so inside of here, you can see this is a multi volume edition. Okay, we're looking specifically here at volume one. We're just covering modules one through 12 here. I know what grade it is, it'll tell me that right there on the binding. And if I flip it over on the back, right above the barcode, it'll do the same thing. Okay, this is a soft cover student write in edition. All of our elementary books are that way. We can see that there's two in the set. And I, I want to start by just kind of diving in and taking a look at some of the components that our students will experience as they go through the Into Math program. So let's take a look first. And I, I like to start here because I think this is worth spending some time on with your students. So this is a family letter that we've included to our students and families. And I wanted to highlight a couple of things here that I think are, are worth noting. First of all, you can see that, that at the core of the program, we're going to be developing skills and making sense of mathematics. And I love that phrase because I think it's so important for our students, not just to solve problems, but to make sense of them. And then notice this here too. We're, we're going to talk a lot about this today. You will learn to persevere when solving problems. So it's that productive perseverance that we want out of our math students. And we're going to build their confidence in math. So important. And we'll spend some time talking about the learning mindset, again, that's embedded inside the pages of both the student book and also the teacher's edition. And then finally down here at the bottom, I love this, you will become a confident user of mathematics. And again, so important, right, that our students have confidence around their ability in math. Let's take a look really quickly at the table of contents. And you'll notice here, as we go through the table of contents, first of all, we're organized by units. Units are those big ideas. And inside of each one of the units, we have multiple modules. So you see for unit one, we have two mo modules. For unit two, we've got six modules and so on. So inside of those modules, you'll also notice that we have different color semicircles next to the different lessons. Okay, and those coordinate to different types of lessons that are inside of that specific module. So you see we have build understanding lessons, we have connect concept and skills, and we have apply and practice. And we'll talk more when we dive into the teacher materials, the differences between those lessons. But I'll tell you, it's a really exciting new feature inside of Into Math. So let's dig into what we're looking at when we talk about a unit. And I want to jump over here to the unit opener pages. So we're looking here. I've gone over to unit two. At the beginning of every unit inside of the program, students have a STEM task. This will relate the math that we're learning back to the real world and maybe even careers that students might want as they move out into the real world. Continuing with the unit opener pages, I've mentioned a couple of times learning mindset and developing that perseverance. And so you'll see this again, not only in the student edition, but also when we go over to the teacher materials. Okay, so then I want to I, I want to spend a little bit of time talking about modules and those module opener pages. So we just looked at unit opener pages. And remember, units cover those big ideas. And then modules, we put together several modules to make up a unit. We sort of break it down into those modules. So we always have this first task where we're asking students questions and we're trying to set the stage, right? We're trying to call on that background knowledge that we hope our students have. And we can develop that a little bit further with some of the turn and talk questions that we ask our students to, to think about. As we turn the page, right after that first module opener page, we will always have an are you ready? And I have to tell you, this is one of the best features of the program. And if, if, you're, if you're familiar with HMH's math programs, you know, this is very similar to the show what you know inside of Go Math. Okay. We really want to collect that data on our students to find out what gaps they may have in their, in their previous understandings. And so then we have some interventions. And again, we'll talk about what those are inside of the teacher's edition. So as we continue, we're going to go, um, we'll, we'll walk through a lesson here. And you can see this is a, this is a 
build understanding lesson. We have a spark your learning task that starts off the lesson. Okay, and this is where we're really asking our students to think about the math from their own perspective. So we ask students to, to answer the questions in, in their own method. And again, we're going to engage our students in a turn and talk. We get our students talking about and thinking about math. We move on to the build understanding, okay, where we're connecting um, the, the, the learning. And as we continue on throughout lessons, you'll see in some of the lessons after the build understanding, we have step it out. So again, we're getting towards that procedural fluency. We're building towards that. And this is where we start working on those steps in that process. Every lesson will have a check understanding. And again, it's about monitoring our student progress so that we can intervene early and often. And then as the students progress on throughout the, the lesson, they'll always have the on your own. That's an opportunity for them to practice. Okay, a great point in the lesson where we can differentiate as well. And then remember, learning mindset embedded throughout. So we're asking our students to be thinking about their progress and their mindset in relation to mathematics. Okay, so we've talked here about the student edition for our Into Math Elementary program. In our next video in the series, we'll be talking about the teacher's edition. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe to the HMH International Content Cares YouTube channel. If you're looking for more content, click on the video to the right of your screen. Welcome to our global community.